we've got an iguana trying to go in the trap. Oh wait, he might just walk right in. All right, let him let him. Let him. What's going on guys? It's your boy the Iguana Man. Thanks for clicking this video. Today we're going to be testing out this new trap to see if we can catch some iguanas. Like, comment, and hit the red subscribe button if you're new. We loaded this box with some of the iguana's favorite foods. Fresh fruit. There's only one door. We made this out of a chicken coop. Let's see if we can catch some. It seems like the iguanas are very curious, but are having a hard time getting inside the trap. Remember, there's a funnel. Once they get in, they cannot escape. As you can see, there's a herd of iguanas extremely curious about the trap and the bait but they seem to be kind of smart not to go in. Oh, well we have one confirmed in the trap, a little one. Maybe this might encourage the others to get inside there and get trapped. Success! We have a large female that just entered the trap. Remember, the females can have up to 60 eggs, so this is a really good one to have captured. Now that we have her successfully trapped, I think she's starting to realize that, hey, maybe this wasn't such a good idea. She was able to get in pretty easy, but now she's trying to figure a way how to escape. I'm not sure if iguanas can communicate with each other but it seems like she warned this little young one not to enter. As cute and cool as iguanas seem to be, they are causing a lot of destruction to the state of Florida. As mentioned before, there are no natural predators. Once an iguana reaches over three feet, there's very little animals that are willing to take them out. Plus, they're masters of camouflage, swimming, climbing, digging, running, and hiding. Plus, they can bite, tail whip, and scratch, which makes them a very formidable prey item. This 
this iguana is considering committing going inside the box, but it seems like his buddies start warning him, do not come in, it's a trap, and they start freaking out and end up scaring him away. Look at this trap right here. This is genius. It caught, look, see. Oh my God, there's five of them in here. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's six. There's six in here, yeah. Dang, I wish I would've left the camera here. Get up, get up. It's all good. Guys, check it out. Oh, little aggressive. Six iguanas in the trap. We'll roll some of the clip of those iguanas. I wish I would have left the trail camera there again. We would have seen them keep going in. This is kind of smart. Chicken coop. Use the chicken coop. Uh, the key open the room. Put that there. Yeah. Right oh through the door. Yeah. That's where the door. Yeah. This side could have done the same, but I wanted to keep some structural integrity to it. Yeah. And then that side over there opens. Wow, y'all see it right there, man. We trapping all these iguanas. And we got plenty more traps, and the boys are getting them right now. So uh, stay tuned. We're going to give you all the final tally here in a bit on this job. We might break this video down in multiple sections just because the the massiveness of this job. Real quick, I'll show you guys what's going on inside here. Look can't see them, but there are iguanas in there. Problem's only gonna get worse. So, you wanna come out here and help? Hit us up. Maybe you can come on out. Help us fight this war on iguanas. It's a battlefield. We need more soldiers. Come on out. Look. Look at the work. Look at the iguanas. Oh, that's a stunky. Yeah. Gotcha. Oh, that is awesome. Feel that. That feels really cool. Whoa. That does feel really cool. It feels like soft. All right, we're going to have to give you all the count. 